Hello, I'm Gavin from Somerset. Tonight on Late Lunch Behaving Badly, Leslie Ash, Neil Morrissey, Caroline Quinton and Martin Clunes. Cue festive titles, Eric! Welcome to today's late lunch, just two days again till Christmas. And boy, have we been busy. We've been to Santi's Grotto, we've stocked up the fridge. And I put a tasteful 15 foot flashing sleigh on the roof. And <laughs> we've just finished putting up all these lovely lights and decorations. What do you reckon? What do you think? Yeah, good, not good. I'll take that. I'll take that as a go. For some reason, I'm turning into the John Knowles. Sorry about that. that. Sorry, Sorry Don't. Chef. In fact, we've been so busy. We're a little bit behind with our advent calendar, so let's open those last few remaining doors. Right, first door up. Let's see who's behind this. Ah! Yeah. Ah! <laughs> Merry Christmas! Look! <laughs> <Yay>! <laughs> Look at her! Look at her! She is talking Leslie Ash. Now, the next door. I'm going to look to the little card to the right of you. No, my luck. It's probably... <laughs> well, watch your head there, lovely. It's probably smack. Michael Flatley's gyrating Celtic buttocks. Let's see who it is. Surely. No! <laughs> Uh, it's the next one up here. What do we got in here? Oh, oh look! It's the little baby cheeses. <laughs> <laughs> the Gouda shepherd that leads his flock. Now it's a show, Mel, but shut that. Okay. Okay. Shut, shut the, the door. Hello, shut Caroline. Hello, Neil. Hello. So now time to, to open <clears throat> one last door. Who on earth can it be? A Furby? A Noel Edmonds? A chocolate trumpet? Will the answer to my prayers reveal themselves? It's. <laughs> <laughs> It's a non-opening door with Martin Clunes in it. I like that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's see how Neil Morrissey comes back with Martin Clunes! We love him! It is literally... It is literally all our Christmases come at once. So today we say it's, it's late, late lunch, lunch behaving, behaving badly. Oh. Now, oh, oh. now, tonight's bands are a little light. Stop to put my buttocks in your face, Martin. Bless you. Not for the first time. <laughs> today's today's band a little bit like the three oh. wise men, except there are five of them. And they're incredibly, incredibly stupid. Please give it up for Steve, Matt, Smiley, who's a new addition and very, if I may say. Is it Carol Smiley's younger brother? Do you know? I think he might be. Let's ask him later. Uh, Dan and Dom, who's the crumpet with a trumpet. It's Frankincense. Goes to Hollywood! <laughs> Now they say 
too many cooks spoil the broth, but luckily broth's not on the menu because we have an unprecedented four cooks tonight. Please make a din for the first of them. It's Neil Morrissey! <laughs> Hello. Welcome to the house. Well, thank Hello. you very much. Welcome to the kitchen, mate. How are you doing? Oh, I'm in fine fettle, actually. Happy nearly Christmas. Happy nearly Christmas. Very excited. Oh, yes. So good. Can't now, look at the Christmas tree. We want to feel everything. Have you felt your presents? No. No. Don't no, I'm feel not allowed. You get you get hit. Okay. What what are you cooking for us today? Today we're cooking. It's not really cooking. Okay. But, but we're going to make mulled wine. Ooh. Yeah. It gets my, you warm and drunk. My fave. Just one little thing. You're a bit of a wine connoisseur, aren't you? Bit. Right, we've got some old uh, vino here. Just going to chuck some of this in the glass. Yeah. Happy nearly Christmas. Oh, thank you very much. Happy nearly Christmas. You grab that. Yeah. Have a good old sniff, have a swill, have a spit, whatever you want to do. What do you reckon it is? Where's oh, it from? Um, I don't know. Is it a Merlot? I think it's wine, mate. <laughs> it's red. <laughs> it's cheap. <laughs> uh, yes. And um, it's probably from Sainsbury's. It's South Eastern Australian. Is it? Apparently. What is it? Shirak called. Sh Shirak. Jack Shirak. Shiraz. <laughs> Shiraz. Whatever that is. Like it? Mm. Lovely. Beautiful. Shiraz is good. Yeah. Yeah, that's the old vineyard. It's not bad. It's, you know, it's kind of Christmassy. Okay. So, um, <laughs> what, what do we do with the old mulled wine? Well, I tell you then? what we do. You whack it all in there. Right. Whack loads of the wine in there. Shall I put some in there? Yeah, just, in, in fact, the whole bottle, really. The whole yeah, darn Yeah, it depends how many, how many you're doing it for, but... OK. I'd get the whole darn lot in there, get it on the heat. That should be all right for six One months. important thing is not to boil it, because you don't want any of the alcohol to boil away. There you go, that's all in there, OK. See, so it's just got to warm through nice, and as that's warming up, there's a couple of lovely okay. ingredients over here. Have you, have you seen what we've got here? What have you got here, mate? Oh, look, nuts! C who can sit? Do I have to show this to anyone, or have you got it? Nuts! Nuts! No, that's not Meg, but nutmeg. first of all, before, before any of the spices go in... <laughs> I love you trying to be serious, it's very, very good. Very, very strong. You like right. that, don't you? Look, <laughs> Orange juice. Right. Ordinary OJ. Didn't know that. That's yeah. good. It's no, beautiful. no, it's, it's all, it, you know, it kind of sweetens it up a bit so you can actually give it to the children. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, not, not highly recommended. <laughs> just, just a taste. I mean, I don't know how much you want in there, but, you know. Good. Finger testing there. Beautiful. See, that to me tastes all right already. But Lovely. Look, no cloths. Uh, there's cloths down here, Dom. You're absolutely fine. Just because, you know, no. you don't want to put your, your oh, gammy hands everywhere. Oh, sorry. No, you don't want that. But don't I wouldn't worry about there that. There you go. Do you want a cloth? There you go. Yeah. Now, you're in a TV panto, aren't you, this year? Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Um, not... Jack, Jack and the Beanstalk? That's right, yeah. Are you Jack? Are you I the am Beanstalk? Jack. I am Jack. Oh. And, but I claim to be, I have an intimate relationship with the Beanstalk. Oh. And how large is that Beanstalk? Really? Yes, I have to climb all the way to the top and confront the giant. Oh. Who, who's at the top? Silla? No, no. no actually, you never, you never actually see the giant. You see his boots. All oh, right. And you see his legs, but you never actually see the giant. You shouldn't have bought but those beans, Jack. But you shouldn't have bought those beans, you naughty son. <laughs> no, I swapped them for me cow. Oh yes. Who's the cow? Who, who plays the cow? The cow is played by two really nice blokes whose names are what I can't remember. Oh. <laughs> and they're really. There, know, but there are loads of stars in it, though, aren't there? Yeah, who, there's who loads. Is well, it's just me, um, Julian Clary, Moina Banks, um, Griff Rhys Jones, Rob Curling. Is he in it? No, maybe not. No, no, no he's not, not in Rob it. Okay. But no true stars, obviously. Yeah. Um, Aid Edmondson. Lovely. And, you know, people like that. Did I say more Winner Banks? You did, Dylan. You might want to get the other ingredients in the mulled wine. Okay, yeah, let's whack that in. Let's whack in, a, let's whack whack in a stick or two. Cinnamon. Of cinnamon, if, you, if you fancy it there. Beautiful. Not Meg. Not Meg. Always very important. It's going to taste great. If you, Neil, you know. you're, you're not an old novice at this, are you? Because you had um, a pilot, a TV pilot, L Larder Lads. Larder Lads. Oh, yeah, lads. yeah, yes, I TV did. TV chef, the Larder Lads. And there was, there was an item in it called Lego Over Menu or something. <laughs> yeah. What was that? The Lego Over Menu was supposedly what you, when you get someone um, round your flat at a pub, um, it's kind of to get <laughs> your leg over a chick, I guess. Oh. You know. And um, thankfully, it never made air. <laughs> For me, for me, it's spicy haggis that does that. What's this there? What's, is that to Anyone keep your little cooks? piece of cinnamon in? It's a little not... pochette for putting in your thing. Isn't thing. it? Okay, Looking beautiful. There. So there we are. Good nutmeg. Meg. Yeah. Cloves. Okay, cloves. Yeah, well, bung a few cloves in. I, I mean, I don't know. I mean, that's probably too many, but... It's Good for it's, toothache it's as well. It's definitely to taste. That's right, you see. Yeah, so when you wake up really ill okay. and your teeth are falling out, you just right. have a few glasses of that and you'll be all right. Okay, might want to speed things up. Okay, just now this is... Just a tad. Okay, Lovely. all spice. There we Lovely. go. In there. Aww. The heat's on. And, that, and that's it. 
And some, and some fresh orange. Of course, yeah. OK, lovely. Of course, you want some fresh fruit, and this is great in Mould 1. Yeah, I love that. Yeah. OK, now, Neil, cheers for this. You'll be uh, joining us later, obviously, for some festive snacks around the table. But before you go, how's about pulling a cracker? Well, why not? Yeah! <laughs> Oh, uh, disappointingly, not very loud. Go. Okay. Now, do, do you want to read? Yeah, I do. Read, I really do. Yeah, go on. Oh, you got a chess set. Oh, fantastic. Very I'll good. play you later. All right, mate. What did the man say to his wife when Father Christmas flew past the window? It looks like rain, dear. <laughs> possibly play and I love Christmas gags and I also like this and you Santa it could be your lucky day <laughs> now of course everyone in the audience has brought uh, remnants from their office party sort of odd biscuits and bits and bobs but those, those aren't the only souvenirs that they've brought because of course it is the time of year when office photocopiers work overtime ladies and gentlemen show me your duplicated buttocks <laughs> start in this festival of bums. This... It's... <laughs> so, my face strangely protruding from one of your kahunas, madam. Let's put that away. I will keep that. Any more buttocks I can see that are decent. That's very out of focus buttocks. Were you vibrating heavily on there? Are you giving a bit of shimmy? And... Is that the right way? Which way do your buttocks go? <laughs> I think yours are fixed in a slightly different way from mine. They're very good. But kilted buttocks there. Thanks about for bringing those in, everybody. Another big tradition, obviously, at Christmas is snogging. OK. And because we're feeling a little bit family, a little bit festive, we thought we'd allow three lucky women to enter into the competition of a lifetime. It's their chance to kiss the band member of their choice. Now... <laughs> Any, anybody immediately wanting to be picked? Is that good? Which means I can prey on you like a hungry mantis. Now, let me have a... I think Madame Le Tartan Bussocks could be uh, up for a first crack at this. What's your name? I'm Karen. Hi, Karen. And Hi, where yeah. are you from? I'm from Essex. So, an interesting choice, <laughs> interesting choice of national costume there. That's me. Of course, the kilt is began in Essex, really, and then was cruelly ripped off by the snobs. It was, it was, definitely. Now, which band member would you like to snob? Oh, um, Dan. Dan! <laughs> Dan! Take your place, please. In mistletoe, keep it clean, Dan. Family show. <laughs> Dan, kiss Karen. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Thank you. Where shall I go? Ah, you're on the up. Word of advice. Never sit on the aisle in a television show. <laughs> <laughs> so snug at the back, plumb in between lots of other people. What's your name? Tracy. Hi, Tracy. Who would you like to snog today? Matt. Matt. <laughs> Matt, come meet Tracy. Get your elfin butt. Very nice. <laughs> so that was it. OK, side on, because Phil likes to watch. OK. <laughs> and please, please snog away. Matt, this is Karen. <laughs> <laughs> Very And you're quite near the aisle. What's your name? Louise. Hello, Louise. You're looking resplendent and tinsel. Who would you like to snog in the band? Um, best the new one, Smiley, eh? <laughs> Carol's half-brother, approach. There you go. And begin snogging. I'm, oh, I'm taking God. sound effects. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, lad. Steve and Dom, who weren't picked, I'd like you to know that I'm going to make uh, real special points for visiting you later on to uh, redress that balance. OK, thanks to everyone here today. You're looking very festive and I wish you all a very, very happy Christmas and a lovely new year. Now, Mel, with those pointy hats, do you think the band look a little bit like Noddy? I'm not sure, Sue. Um, I'll ask Big Ears. <clears throat> <laughs> that was so cheap. Ladies and gentlemen, Martin Clunes! On today's show. Sorry about that. It's nearly Christmas, apparently. Now, Martin, what are you uh, what are you making? 
Uh, well, Mel, I thought uh, today I'll start with a savoury here. I've got a couple of things here, nice little Christmas ideas. They're mince pie crescents, and those, I forgot what they're called, but they're sausages with nice little bits of bacon on them. They're called so, uh, pigs in blankets, Of course apparently. they are. Not devils on those back, pigs so, in blankets. Um, I'll, I'll run this by you. <laughs> <laughs> what is it's it? very simple. You take the sausage right. and uh, you wrap it. <laughs> um, so I'll pop that there. Lovely. Those and uh, here's another friend. one. Look, I'm, watch closely as I'm wrapping that. Martin, yeah, you're really good, mate. That is beautiful. With a piece of, and then there's a paintbrush with this mustardy business, you're which going, uh, you can, uh, you know. It's a sort of mustard and honey sauce that's, that's going on there. Is it? Lovely. Lovely. Well, it's going on. It's quite fun doing that. So bit, from actually. savory, from savory so to savory, sweet. So savory, segueing swiftly onto the sweet. Uh, well, just I've finished doing that. I'll pop these in the oven for um, five to ten minutes, but they're on regular two. <laughs> Whatever. On regular now, too. Moving on. Martin, what have we here? Uh, now here we have these lovely ideas. If you can't eat a whole mince pie, eat a half a one. And here's a ready-made half a mince pie for you. So we'll take a little, little spooning of that there. You they're see, now, mince pie that, crescents. That's right, they sure yeah, are. And this beautiful. has got some sort of beans in it. It's got chickpeas and nuts and some spaghetti. How I modern? By the look of it, I don't know what that is. So very simple. Watch closely here. As I'm turning that over, yeah. Put a little bit much in that one. That's for greedy boys. And there, like so, and just, just a little You're pinch, doing a little, little pinch, pincering little, movement around the edge. That's or you'll lovely. Squish it to nothing. Okay, super. And uh, dust that with some of that because that's what they do, and pop it there. Martin, you're very commanding, mate. Thanks you're very much. Very, it's, very uh, commanding. All bluster and no real. Um, is this all the directing you've been doing? Because you're a little. So. The showbiz bird has told me that you've been doing a bird. little bit of directing. A little bit of directing. Are nice. you going to do more of that than acting? That a bit? No. I mean, I don't know, really. I'm just going to have to be asked, won't I? I'll see. I could go completely out of fashion on all scores. Never. Never. Never, well, Martin. I'm ready for it. I've obviously never given up my paper round. There. <laughs> and uh, I can do that Superb. too. You little Christmas thing. Hey! And then these. You pop in. Superb. Oh, well done, well, Martin. You are. You are. You rock, mate. Hey, hey. The mulled wine is boiling. Let's just turn no, that No, no, you don't want it down. to boil because all the alcohol will go. Just a little bit. OK. Now, Martin, we'll all be snacking together on your... Do you want to put it down there? Yeah, just put it down. OK. okay. <laughs> We're going to be snacking together on your festive treats a little bit later, but first we'd like you to crank up the festive factor by donning oh, this beautiful Santa Claus beard, How lovely. if you would, Bless and trailing it. us into the break in the style of the big man himself, Mr. Sandy Claus. Martin puts beard on. Ho, ho, ho. ho uh, that there, one. You oh, there you are. Oh, you're over there again. Ho, ho, ho. Join us after the break when we'll be carrying on our badly behaved Christmas More like Father Christmas, Martin. More like Father Christmas. Lower, deeper. Do you want me to yeah, go, go back on. again? Yeah, yeah, keep go going. On. Deeper, deeper. I'll pick it up first. But badly oh. behaved Christmas party with Neil Mott. <laughs> What is he it's good, mate. No, it's yeah. good. It's good. With, with Neil Morrison, Leslie Ash, Caroline Quentin, and me, Silly. We'll also be playing our, our jolly festive foodie sport shot food. Ho, ho, ho. So I'm reading this really badly. See you in Christmas tree. Hey! To late lunch, behaving badly with Leslie Ashley, Morrissey, Caroline Quentin, and Martin Clunes. Good lord, what a fantastic guest list! Now, 1998 is almost over with under two. That's a great move, Melons. Let's not <laughs> let's not do that again. Must just show my sock and my leg. There we go. <laughs> Sorry about that. So, oh dear. Oh hello. Very uh, pale. I've already caused the camera to flash then with the paleness. Of my calf. Now, 1998 is almost over with under 200 hours to go until 1999. So, just in case this year has passed you by, here's the ups, the downs, the ins and outs of an Annus Memorabilis. The biggest story of the year was the Clinton scandal. Basically, Hillary went out. Monica popped in. Bill perked up. Pants came down. Cigar went in. Bill splashed out. Spain showed up. Chips were down. But Bill held out. Till the tests came in. And the truth came out. Still, the polls went up. Meanwhile, at home, Peter Mandelson wouldn't back down. So the dome went up. Nothing went in. Time's running out. Meanwhile, on Clapham Common, Ron Davis went out. A bloke came up. <laughs> Something went down. An outing came back in. <laughs> and at the flicks, Titanic came out. Water came in. Ship went down. Takings went up. Well, 
Everyone loves a disaster. Look at EastEnders. Ruth was down about the bills. Something was up. Mark moved in. Connor stepped in. Roy was down. Roy freaked out. Tried to do himself in. He and Frank, I'm doing the same voice. Frank made up. <laughs> Sweetheart. <laughs> Grant screwed up. Tiff listened in. He lashed out. She fell down. Ambulance turned up. Tiff's rushed in. Pulse went down. Tiff checking out. No! <laughs> Whoa! Meanwhile, in Spice World... Jerry stood down. Posh was knocked up. Scary joined in. But Sporty's left out. And yo-yos were in. Yo-yos went down. Yo-yos came up. Yo-yos went down. Yo-yos came up. Viagra came out. Yo-yos stayed up. Now, it's time to dish out. It's time to tuck in. It's time to chow down. So good to shut up. Good. Now, 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 our final chefs provide the tasty filling for the couch potatoes of men behaving badly. Please applaud very loudly. Yes. For the one, the only, Leslie Ash and, and another Caroline, one, the only. And another one, only, Caroline Quentin! Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous, the two of you. And you too. Thank you very Cheers. much. No. How are you doing? Very good, thanks. Yeah, excellent. Fantastic. Cheers, cheers for coming. Now, what are we? Uh, what are we going to do? We've got some sort of brandy creamy. cream over there. Brandy cream. Yeah. Uh, uh, and over here, um, mulled wine. Mulled wine, indeed. Uh, and little and, and little <gasps> sticks for the little sausages. <laughs> so, would you mind, Callum? Should I get the, them out yeah, of the oven? Do you want the other uh, comedy mitt on? I will do. There you go. Where, oh, that's the oven. Now you're obviously good mates. Absolutely, yes. Besties on screen, besties off screen. Well, we've been together now for eight years, which is a long time. Oh, what, what do you do on a sort of typical girls' night out, the two of you? Gosh, um, we're... Um, um, we, we do knitting <laughs> and... Yes, um, yeah. Crochet. Oh. Swap recipes. Yes. Do you? No, we do what the boys do. Oh. Yeah. Lagers. Lager. <laughs> hey. I'm going to pop some sticks in here. I don't know if anyone at home's ever done this before. It's, um, I am going to wear a harness and a hard hat. <laughs> um, I hope just, these are cooked. Just pop into the oven for a second. Or I left oh, something in there. There's nothing in there. We're absolutely fine. <laughs> <laughs> that was a panic. She didn't That's not my Christmas day, that one. <laughs> Forget to put the turkey in. I'll just get the turkey. Oh, no! <laughs> Do you find at Christmas that you sort of jog around the kitchen? Yeah. It's sort of slightly panicked, always yeah. just a little very bit sweaty. like that. It's Not very quite sweaty. knowing what right. you're oh, I dear. tend to like to do everything the day before. The turkey yes. the day oh, before. But you're very well organised, Leslie. Yeah, you? are you? Well, with two children you have to be. So, so you do you prepare everything literally? The turkey two I do... Two boyfriends you have to be quite organised <laughs> as well, actually. <laughs> <laughs> the turkey you have to do the day before because my aga can only get a turkey in it. You can't get anything else in it, so oh, you have no. to do it the day before. So what do you do with your veg, ladies? <laughs> Mind your own business. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, I, yes, I, I prepare them. Um, I can't uh, believe I asked that question. <laughs> I can't believe I answered it like that. Um, I've done my sausages. Good. I'm very pleased with them. I think they look beautiful. Brandy creams. Right. Leslie, yes, well, I've, I've got these lovely uh, mince pie presents. presents. I'm going to lean over, sorry. Go for it, love. Right. And I've got this, uh, this cream, in fact. I'm going to make brandy cream, which is the brandy in here, which I suppose is about like two <laughs> tablespoonfuls. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry, I just wanted to look at my so next question. Sorry, sorry. On the car. Okay. So you put Thanks, that sorry. in there and you mix that up. And there you have your... Is that why it's called brandy, brandy cream? Brandy cream, Leslie. Brandy cream. Yes. Leslie Ash making brandy and cream I'm there. Just going to, I'm going to plate these up onto here, Could Leslie. Could you plate yeah. up for us? Could you leave On they go. I've got to ask you, Caroline. Now, now, in old Jonathan Creek... Yes, indeed. Is Maddie ever going to get it together with him? For Pete, you keep us hanging well, on. Well, uh, in, in the Christmas one, I have to say the answer is... No. Oh. But, 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 there is a whole new series next you year. And anything kidding. could happen. There are six hours of it. So I'm sure to get at least a heavy duty snog, I'd have thought, of wouldn't course, you? Mate. Sorry, Les, can I, I pass anything yeah, over? I need, I need to. Do you need the plate? She needs need the plate. It's plate going up my, back to um, Leslie over mince here. Pie. So um, here we have. I oh, you've on the other end. Sorry, know, Leslie. Can see hey, could, here, would you mind jugging up? Jugging up. Okay, excellent. I'm going to put my mince pies on here. Jugging up. Sorry. And then we'll. Sort of put those put some nice have, have Neil and Martin ever cooked, uh, cooked a meal for yeah, you? Yeah, they're b both of them. They're both very good cooks, actually, despite what you've witnessed earlier with that mince pie for I was a bit worried about Neil's nutmegging. It was I think a he over nutmeg. No, but he was nutmeg. talking, wasn't he, at the same yeah, time? Was. You know what men are like. They can't do the two things at once. I know, Zoe. <laughs> so that's that. <laughs> I'm going to leave the fruit in there because it's a bit of, um, it's Beautiful. A, bit of a small top for that. Yep, yeah, that's tip top. Are you ready there, Leslie? I think so, yes. Yeah. Just Thanks a bit of very bring this over. Yeah, do. Thanks very, very much. We've seen them apart. Now let's see them in the all together, or at least all together. So, Band, are you hungry? Yes! Audience, are you hungry? Yes! Oh, 
Leslie and Caroline, are you hungry? You can stay. Are you hungry? <laughs> oh, yes! yes. <laughs> then then let, let's eat a badly behaved festive late lunch. Introductions have you met before? Leslie, Martin, Martin, oh, Carol, oh, oh, Neil, oh, Martin, oh, Melon, oh, Sue, oh, Sue oh, hello, oh, greeting. Oh, silly me, <laughs> just realised. Now, I want to know, I've become obsessed with the range of photocopied buttocks that I was looking at oh. earlier. Which leads me to the question have you ever photocopied your own assets? No. No? I Never. Never. No, no, I haven't either. I will. Though. Well, Bring I on the photocopier, <laughs> it's time. No, 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 because I tried it once and the photocopier wouldn't have it. Why? Uh, it, it just uh, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Carry it and on and on. Can I just say, lads, happy Christmas? Happy Christmas! Happy Christmas. Cheers! Cheers. Absolutely. Cheers. Nice one. Yeah. Cheers! Happy Christmas! Happy Christmas! Happy Christmas! I see you've added some kumquats to this yeah. well next year. What was yeah. the last office party you went to? Seeing as we're trying to theme this around the old office party. Do you, do you have a member behaving badly, sort of? Yeah, we had a bash. Party. We had a bash at the end of the, uh, the last recording. Yeah, yeah someone some blew up some balloons. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And that was, was the party. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, which was nice. A few um, balloons. But no, we don't really have office parties. No. no. We're having one. Yeah. So no snogs in the mobile station right. covered or anything like that? Not that we know. No, no. exactly. Yeah. And then it goes on. It does go yeah. on. So I'd, I'd imagine. Yeah. Filing cabinets always. Really? For me, like a it's a dimly lit stockroom. It's like a magnet to me. Now, obviously, in your, in, your, in your time, you've been asked hundreds of thousands of different questions about men behaving badly. So we thought we'd come up with a new one. Don't look at my answers, but thank you. <laughs> You're probably thinking you've been asked every question possible. Here we go. Which 5th century badly behaved man plundered his way through Europe, was called the Scourge of God, and ate his two sons? Oh. It wasn't um, Rolf Harris. Wasn't Philip Schofield. No, it wasn't good last Philip Schofield. No, it wasn't him. No, it wasn't. Attila the Hun. Yes, it was. Oh, yeah. For no points at all. Oh. We haven't got a prize, me. but that was. Ate his own son. What would your specialised subject be on Mastermind? Would it be Attila the Hun? Is that why you got that right? Probably makeup. Makeup? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so you reckon makeup? She likes makeup. I like that. What about you, Neil? What would your specialist subject be? Probably um, animals of a bovine nature. Ah. Just cows? Yeah, just cows. Just cows, yeah. just showing about cows. Okay. Cows, okay. cows and stuff that comes out of them. Okay. <laughs> Let's Obviously. not take that road. Let's go down the other road, the, the <laughs> sunny road that isn't to do with cows and their stuff. Um, Caroline, what would your specialised subject be in Mastermind? Um, probably be either... I should think art or, or gardening, I'd have thought. Oh, art. gardening. Mm. Art or gardening. Mm. Good woman. Mm. Cool. Do you have a truck? I, not anymore. I used to when I had a garden. Mel's obsessed with trugs. Yeah, they're beautiful. Trugs are lovely, yeah. Trug. 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 They're lovely, yeah. Trugs are so cool. Shallow, yeah. often made of wood. Sometimes yeah, mobile, you kneel on them. Yep. No, you don't kneel on a trug, though. No, no. You put your veg on the trug. What about you, Martin? I'm passing this around to you. What would your specialised subject be? Oh, blimey, I don't know. I think it'd be good to have Magnus Magnusson as your specialised subject. I think that would really freak him out, wouldn't it? It's you, Magnus. I like the telly. <laughs> you have to go on telly at it. Um, now, you, as you say, you just re recorded the last ever. Is it true it's the last ever, no more, not yeah, even I a think follow? So. I think so, yeah. Really? Isn't that really and sad? And yet you're looking really happy. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. There's no sadness at all there. It's been a long oh. sentence. So, oh. so oh. It doesn't take as long as you'd think. Well, given the number of repeats that are on it, it only takes two months in the year. I mean, we'll have a nice two months every year. Yeah. yeah. And it sort of feels quite natural to finish. And you all hang out anyway. So it's we all so hang right out. <laughs> what was the? <laughs> what were your last way. lines? Give us your last lines that you had to say. Your final, the oh, final curtain. Oh, That's good, a secret, good point, isn't it? actually. It's um, a bit of a secret, isn't it? Um, Goodbye. Because um, hang on, because the, the first. Yeah, thing I, know I can tell you my last tomorrow, line. So. I know mine. I wasn't going to. Oh yeah, that's right. That yeah. doesn't give anything away. Um, that's good. Mine um, was. Dorothy, any chance of <laughs> tonight? <laughs> oh no, yeah, in your own time when you're ready. And mine, and mine was. Why didn't we do this ten years ago? I'm not saying what that was. Oh! Mm. How about you, Leslie? Can you remember your last... Or does it give too much away? No, it was... Oh, Tony, don't. Oh, that is <laughs> yeah. Very of continuing the theme of previous episodes. Yeah. Can you not give us a, a clue yeah, as go to what on. goes on? Not even a hint no. or a whisper no. of a clue? No, it'd be unfair. All right. In that case, <laughs> I want to talk about fantasy casting because there was an American, or still is, I don't know, an American version of MBB. Mubba, mubba, as we call it. Who I don't know who actually did play your roles, but who would you have loved to have played your roles if you could pick any Hollywood actor, actress? Who would it be? 
Um, difficult, difficult, difficult. At, at any age in their life. Yes. Yeah. Yes. At any point in their career. I'd like Kathy Bates to have played my part. She's cool. Yes, I do. She is rocking. Thank you. Dirty Meg Ryan, me. Adore Meg Ryan. Yeah. yeah. Oh, adore Meg Ryan. And yeah. Not a dissimilar me. look, I have to say. But Very similar. <laughs> it's groovy that hair. I think Cary Grant could have done a good job. I think he would have been rocking. Yeah, I'd have liked that. Yeah, Cary Grant would have been great. What about you, Martin? <laughs> and for you? Uh, I think Tony Curtis in Trapeze. You know, when he was like hot with the. Tight trousers and Quite sinister yeah. shorts. Tight trousers. Yeah. Sinister shorts? Sinister shorts. <laughs> they were a bit sinister. Yeah. Sinister. Sinister. I feel very jovial, I must say. I feel on the tipsy side of all right. It's true. Neil, Neil and Martin, do you do DIY? Quite a lot. No, I'm rubbish at DIY. <laughs> and Ma Martin. The showbiz bird lied again. again. <laughs> we heard that you look at the hand with the old, you know, oh, putting it on. Oh, yeah. like no, him, yeah. he's ace at it, you know. Because you've got a new pad in Dorset, haven't you? That's right, yeah. Uh, are you doing it up? Not really doing it up, so I'm trying to find things to do that I don't really do. I'm building a workbench at the moment. You yes. You can buy them, you just buy them. I know, but I've got to build something. <laughs> um, I don't know quite what to build when I built my workbench, but I'll, I'll have oh, a bench. You've got to be doing shelving, surely. Shelving. You've yeah. made beautiful shelves before. I've seen. I them. have made really some nice, be really nice shelves. Beautiful woodwork. Oh, no, you wouldn't know to look at him, would you? <laughs> <laughs> Do you have a tool belt? I have one, but I don't. I I, I, I sort of save it for a Friday. <laughs> okay. When, the oh, special no, we're not touching no, on not that. Yeah. No, no, let's uh, not go there. No. <laughs> uh, is it true your parents own a wallpaper and paint shop, Leslie? Yes, they have. So has the DIY tradition carried on? Well, you yeah, I get that? cheap paint, yeah, so... But do you actually paint your own, like, hat walls and stuff? Yes, I do. Cool. I, I, I like all that. I, I like buying those magazines, you know, trying to get my house to look like them, but with two children, obviously, it doesn't really work. Also, because everything has to be <laughs> white. Yeah, they, they put a toy down, I say, put it away, you know. <laughs> Not near my walls, you know. <laughs> what about you? Any... Because I, I... You're into gardening, aren't you, basically? Yeah, I don't have a garden anymore. I now have a balcony, which is a lot oh, of fun. Um, you can do a lot with a balcony, can you? Can, I know. I'm very happy you, with container gardening. It's like I know. The and yourself? Mm. Container. Mm. Actually, only it's container. Like, a lot oh, of pots. Fantastic. Bit of bed edge, but uh, yeah. many pots. Sorry, quite dull, but there but you, you go. Used to, yeah. you used to have a big acre and a half. Well, on, <laughs> a big acre and a half. On Caroline's roof terrace, you can often find tartan milling about up there. Yeah, it's very jungly up there. Yeah. Is it true, Caroline? You once possessed a strimmer, whatever that is, a sort of large hacking instrument, a sort of. Strimmers are the things that you use. The side of your lawn. Oh, and, the edging. Um, and when I first got it, I was <coughs> trying to rewire the plug of it. <laughs> and I didn't unplug the one end from the end that was in my hands. And I was sitting there, and my dog was <laughs> Ollie was sitting next to me. Ollie was, and I was, he was sitting leaning against me. And I was fiddling with the thing like that, and I got this massive electric shot. I mean, a really, really. And my hair, my sister was looking at me, <laughs> my hair stood up on it like that, and so did the dogs. <laughs> Electric by road like strimmer. Yeah, you still like it. it. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's never grown back properly, has it? Oh, oh, has it done? Yeah, really, I'm really joking. You gel it down now. Yeah. Keep yeah. the hair it very, very quite flat. It's frightening, actually. Really. Uh, I want to talk in a, in a very weird, linky fashion, from strimmers to directing, which obviously you've done. Very cool, link there. Okay, cool. yeah. I, I press on. Yeah. He's, really com is, he's commanding obviously. in the kitchen, though. No, very commanding in the kitchen. <laughs> the kitchen, for now, <laughs> doesn't interest me. <laughs> the kitchen is <laughs> now in the oh, Talk about which is your latest project, which, yes. which Neil Neil's in, in. Lord, and yep. you play a transsexual in it. That's right, yeah. Was he a good girl? Did he make a good girl? Beautiful, yeah. Aww. She was lovely. Was what foot, was your lady's uh, name? My na lady's name was Charlotte. Charlotte. Yeah. Yeah, what Charlotte. was your hair like? Long I had well, I had my own, I had my own hair, but I had extensions put in, Aww. so I had my own hair. Was like out here. It was really big, and I grew my own nails. So it was like your yeah. hair before. Yeah. Yeah, it was like my hair, my old hair, but it was just. And long nails, Neil, you had? I grew, I grew my nails. Ooh, I grew my own nails. Really beautiful really? long nails. And I was, I was shaved from here to the top of my trouser yeah. line. <laughs> to there. And just below the trouser triangle. line, down to my ankles. So I kind of had a set of hair shorts. Oh, I've got those. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh, you've got enough of the yeah. forest of Arden. Uh, you should get a strimmer. Yeah. <laughs> Good link. Get all stand up on it. <laughs> seamlessly back to strimming. Oh, so, but what, oh how did you presume? So you had to wear a padded bra and everything. No, I had a prosthetic. Yeah, which bosoms, was, um, bosom yeah, day. Six-hour makeup job. His with first them. outfit was off the. <gasps> do you mind? I'll, I'll tell you. Do it. Was this blue sequin, very picker hugger, um, <laughs> off the strapless <laughs> number with bosoms that swang. They swang. Oh yeah, yeah. They swang. Past tense of swing. So they swang. <laughs> 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 
I was, only, I was just demonstrating my swing, you see. That was this is, this is what he does if I go off into some long ass <laughs> anecdote. <laughs> but if you'd have the breasts, the, I'd have gone flying. Oh, no, it's fine, you're beautiful. We've lost a few come quite along the way, but no, no, how are we all? Just no. go back to the kitchen for so a second. So, Neil, what was Martin like as a, as a director? Was he dictator? Was he mellow? What kind no, of it was, role? No, it was really cool. I mean, obviously, it's a hard job when you're, when you're in it and you've got a director as well, but you know, he managed. He was I a cool used man. to direct Neil like this, apparently, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> what was that? No, I used to oh, sit no. at the monitor watching Neil do his takes like that. Because I'm, I'm a woman. <laughs> <laughs> he, actually, he actually told off someone for calling me a slapper. Yeah. No, <laughs> she's not. She's a lady. <laughs> All right. right. So she's very sweet. <laughs> yeah. I like right, you defending your women. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Is it true? Gary yeah. Newman had a part as well. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. White right. makeup, or did he just? Same old, he looks just a, just the same. Exactly. Yeah, he's, the same. Very pale. he's very He's very pale. Well, that's his thing. Yeah. Makeup. 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 Did yeah. he return the favour? Did he, did he let you in on any of his stuff? Ah, uh, <laughs> yes, he did. I played bass with him. Uh, in, a, in a gig? At the Shepherd's Bush Empire for one song. Quite oh. a big gig. Yeah. Well, how did, he, how did you go on. down, that's worth? Uh, absolute storm. So, adolescent dream come true. It's fantastic. <gasps> Which song did he do? Cars. Oh, oh yeah. It's oh, the best that song. That is a yeah, classic yeah, bass yeah, line. Yeah, yeah, she did the yeah, whole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 No, it's more money for you, It's faster this time. But these times, he has a it's real sort of young, sexy band. He's like, da 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 one thing only, <laughs> what would it be? <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you didn't ask me that one. <laughs> <laughs> I think they that... won't. <laughs> bacon. I could bacon. never go without bacon. Uh, in which bacon. case, have my piggy in the blanket. Thank you. Oh, no. Now, Neil, how it's much do you pay for a haircut? Oh, God. Not um, enough. Not, probably. <laughs> yeah, not enough. Um, I, not very much, I don't know. Um, I think the last time I paid for a haircut, uh, about... Three and a half quid. Three and a half quid. That's pretty good. Good man. Okay, Caroline, when did you last have hysterics? <laughs> <laughs> a few moments ago, actually. <laughs> 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 I, I, I have hysterics quite regularly, actually. All right, all right. I actually <laughs> 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 all right, leave it, leave it. I am, I am an hysteric. <laughs> it's so like, regularly. It's um, like sort of Stuart Hall. The other night. <laughs> 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 Here comes the Belgians. Yeah, I'm certified being insane. Um, no, no, no. Yeah, no, a lot. A I, lot. Last night. I won't tell you what I was doing. Mm -hmm. Right. Crash on. OK. <laughs> Martin, what's, uh, what's the naughtiest thing you've done this year? And you've got to be honest, the Ooh. naughtiest thing you've done naughtiest this year. Naughtiest Martin, thing. for Christ's sake, And clean, sake, apparently. Honest. Did I say that? Don't say that, because it's <laughs> baby Jesus. Because baby Jesus. Yeah. Oh, God, oh, blimey. The naughtiest. The naughtiest. I'd, OK, I'd, I nicked a tangerine from the green room earlier. Oh. <laughs> no, no, that's it. No, 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 oh, come on. No. It's all right. Pay, all right, pay. OK. Our snacks are your snacks. Hey. We'll share them. Please join us after the break when we're playing the ultimate Christmas sport. It's shot pud. Do you see? Yeah. It's, yeah. it's shot pud, but with a pudding. With a pudding. It's a Christmas oh, pudding. Oh, yeah. Isn't that pudding. good? We'll be having a good old Christmas snog as well. We'll see you in three French hens. Good evening. <laughs> Singleton Here and we Leslie go. Judd, the Fab <laughs> Four, they never die. Welcome back to Late Lunch, behaving badly with Leslie Ash, Neil Morrissey, Caroline Quentin and Martin Clunes. That's we've right. cooked, we've chatted, yeah, right. we've snacked and so now it's time for yet another food sport that'll sweep the streets of the nation. <laughs> they're fruity, they're round and you throw them to the ground. It's your foot, it's your foot. They're fruity, you got the they're round, round and we throw them to the ground. Boys, be happy. 
Christmas rules for shop put are very, very simple. Each player has one Christmas pudding. They are pre-war and most definitely stale, which they must throw in traditional shop put style to Show me. a little bit It's like Jeff like Capes that. with more facial hair in my oh, face. Oh, right. Like can do that. You've got, to, you've, got to, you've got to shot your put or put your shot <laughs> into the not-so-traditional novelty chocolate target over there. Yes. Whoever gets their pudding closest to the mince pie in the centre of the target wins. You must launch your puddings from within the customary Satsuma circle. If you step outside of the Satsuma circle before releasing your pudding, you will be disqualified, okay? <laughs> As is traditional in shot pud, the competitor with the whitest teeth goes first. Melly, if I may cover you, just briefly there. Cover me, down. In the walk, show <laughs> me your ganaches. <laughs> Caroline, let's see those pearly whites. Oh. That's a very strong contender. Very Martin, very good. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Ne oh. Neil's are sort of glimmering. I think it's going to be Caroline, though. I yeah. don't know. Yeah. Yeah. So, so I think it's Caroline. Good. Thank you very yeah. much. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Now, you got so. to say, have you taken any steroids? Uh, not this morning. Good, this okay. That's all I need to know. Well, Ladies and gents, is, Caroline it. is going to go first. Go on, girl. Putting the shot. Band. It's many years since I've done this. I want you to know that. All right. You have yeah, to start with a true pro. Okay, band, some music, please. Propel it. Go, go, Martin, go, Martin. Go, Martin. Throw your pudding, Martin. He's looking confident. Oh, Come on, Martin. sexy Martin, throw it. <gasps> oh, wow. Wow. Very good. Out of the circle. Yours landed here, my little Leslie. Get yourself into the circle. Oh, there goes. Oh, Susie, no. you can let it all. Martin is the winner. Yeah. Martin. Yeah. Susie is the winner. Yes. And Martin, your prize this evening is a clip from the Men Behaving Badly Christmas Special. Ooh. Debs and I have got some news of our own. Debs agreed that I should move in with her. What's wrong with my flat? Well, nothing, but, well, when you grow older, you want a fully grown-up relationship, don't you? And Deborah sometimes wanders around the flat in just her pants, and I really like to walk. Very good. Can I just say, in comedy darts, that was 180, whatever accent that was. Good, mate. I think it was Portuguese. It was good, though, though. Is it what old Portuguese he is now? Now, you All graced righty. us with your presence. It's only fair we grace you with our presence. Yeah. So, um, I present. Best gift here. It's just like Blue Peter, lads. Do you remember Peter Purvis always got the soap on a rope? Every time. He was always <laughs> wearing a medieval costume I when know. he did it. I Caroline, that's yours Thank the first you gift. Thank you, Mark. May I open it now? Open it now. Excellent. Really? Mm. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Ouch. Neil. Oh. You can all open. It's a season. That's Martin. That's Martin. There you go, Martin. Yeah. Okay. Very good. Quite small. Quite small. Martin is the smallest. We didn't bring you it's a thing! It's a thing! <laughs> it's for you! It's your thing with it! It's your dog! <laughs> Open house at Mel's. Open yeah. door. No, oh, I'm staying at home in my flat, and my family are coming to me, and I'm going to cook for them. Yeah, I'm mm. going to the Virgin Islands. <gasps> oh. So show me. That is top top brilliant. Yeah. You'll come out with a tan and everything. That's so I cool. Will. So beach, <laughs> chilling out, doing all that stuff. Neil, what about you? Where are you going for us? Mexico. Yay! <laughs> we like it. <laughs> you have a nice like it. Like yeah. it. Like that. Like um, a bit of town and a bit of the uh, the, the candy I love of the best, Dorset. 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 Oh, and you wear your tie I'll in your country pad. I'll be wearing my tie as I kill small animals. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everywhere. <laughs> Leslie, what is on top of your Christmas tree? I know there's something quite special on the top of the tree this year. Well, my, my son 
a six-year-old son, Max, actually made an angel for our, the top of our Aww. Christmas tree. Can we and see? Here it is here. That is Max's angel. Oh, Check Max. Oh. 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 Show them the colours on the wings. Quite good. Oh, that's oh. very good glitter. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah. Good glitter work. I am so old. proud that I was asked to bring this today. Oh, oh. it's excellent. We like talking, them. talking of kids, we've got a, a, a certain picture of a young Caroline Quentin mm. in her nativity play as Chief Shepherdess. Yeah. <laughs> I'm very good. Oh. I'm very, very jealous of Mary. Can you see? I wanted to play Mary, and I looked really annoyed. Did you audition for Mary? I did. I was never asked. Caroline. If I'd have been asked, I'm sure I'd have got the part. But she had a foil halo. Oh. I was green with it. I, I played. <laughs> I played the part of Jesus. It was really. Did you? Dumb. I just had to. Where do you go from there? Exactly. You start there. And there's only one place to go. I exactly. played about twelfth angel from the right. I was actually kicked off the podium. So my singing was so bad. That was terrible. Fell off. No. I know. Mm. Oh, I was the Icelandic fisherman. <laughs> what kind of school did you go to? It was a modern progressive, <laughs> obviously multiracial school they were trying to bring. I don't know, the Icelandic fisherman, obviously. <laughs> Who, and he was Didn't at the, the bar. Wasn't there one in your Yeah, yeah. yeah. he was there. Oh, the I know, I played Mary, I have to you, say that. Really? I didn't. But I, I only got Mary because the girl who actually did get the part of Mary couldn't remember her lines. I don't know how I got it because I never, never remember my lines. <laughs> Lads, obviously partners accepting. Let's draw a veil over that. Who would you kiss under the mistletoe? If Who you had the choice of anyone mm -hmm. under the old mistletoe. Uh, Martin, oh. Neil. Oh, um, who would I kiss under the mistletoe? I'd like to have someone interesting and, and fun. <laughs> Whose name alludes to that? Yeah. Just a, kiss. See, I, <laughs> Just a nice, fun, interesting I'd like person. someone shallow and thick. <laughs> <laughs> and highly available. Oh, come on, then. Oh, no. <laughs> Stuff. Are you all kind of gifted up? Oh, yes. yeah, yeah. You're not going to go. Two days to go. Are you going to give it up? I was going for the tomorrow Christmas Eve kind of last oh, minute no. song. Don't yeah, I have to admit, no, that's no. a bit me as well. But you do find that there's quite a lot of places that are emptied out because everyone's scared of shopping on Christmas Eve. So, so yeah. hardly anyone's out there. They all know I'm there. Yeah. Yeah. Morris is coming. Morris yeah, is coming. Yeah, get oh, home. Yeah. Leslie, what's the most expensive present you bought this year? Are you like, oh, you can't do it. If it's your kids, you can't No, I think it's actually for myself, and that's the outfit I have on tonight. Very, <laughs> nice. very so strong. You, you've, mis you've misunderstood the idea of Christmas. It's giving to others, <laughs> not buying a new dress for yourself. And yeah, but the, the thing is, you spend all this money buying presents for other people. I don't know whether you're the same. And then you get. Rubbish. Yes, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Absolute yeah. rubbish. I think, I'm, I think I'm getting an umbrella. <laughs> Once I got given an A4 file. For Christmas, with not oh, even any stationery. No. My mum gave me an umbrella once, and then she cried in the bath all night as she realised. Was that related to the umbrella incident? No, oh. she'd realised just what a bad present it had been. Oh. And I was great. Oh. She was. She was, was nice. At least she had the goodness. At least she had the goodness to go to the bathroom and cry. All yeah. Night. yeah, what a good woman. I know. Exactly. She's she a top. She's a top majestic woman. Out of all of you, who does the washing up? In your house? Who on, Christmas, on Christmas Day. Yeah. Well, on the day. Yeah. No, nothing gets done on the day. I mean, do you done. wash up at all? Do oh, yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. You share it out? Yeah, loads. Okay. Dishwasher. 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 Yeah. Dishwasher. Dishwasher. Yeah. Dishwasher. Dishwasher. Yeah. Dishwasher. Dishwasher. Yeah. Dishwasher. Yeah. Dishwasher. 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 D